we just want to do a quick video here to uh, to show on a chart actually what we mean by using a buy stop to enter position. So here is Ethereum Classic. You can see here on a, this is a short term chart, one hour. You can see possibly this is preliminary support. Then we had a selling climax. And then you can see big volume came in for an automatic rally and then a secondary test. And we came up and extended the upper range of the trading range, upper boundary. Then we came back here and we're going to back and fill and accumulate, hopefully. So, you know, you could put a buy in here if you choose. You could buy a, a further test down at the bottom. But we want to explain why using a buy stop. So in this case, if you think that Ethereum Classic will finally be ready to go to the upside once, let's say, the $18 level is reached, then you would put a buy stop to buy at 18 when it's touched. And normally that'd be a market order. So therefore put an order to buy Ethereum Classic ETC at 18 on a buy stop. That way when it does finally touch 18 and you think it's ready to go, you would enter a position at that point when you think it's really going to extend its gains quickly.